Hey Lars, well in Shanghai we've seen workers actually returning. Construction workers can be seen on site. There's no actual progress to show, but the good news is we're underway and it is essentially day one, so we'll keep an eye on that. At the north end of Berlin, where we were looking at the parking lot, well, it now has lighting that's been put in. On the roof of the main building, the solar panels are expanding, and the array that we saw facing east is likely to be mirrored facing west as well. In the south end of the building, parking lot area, the trees have been put in and other landscaping, and to the east of that, more parking has been expanded and graded, and uh, it's underway. The 4680 building is finally showing some meaningful progress from the outside. Most of the walls are up, and interior work has begun in earnest. It's finally looking pretty good in terms of getting done by the end of the year. The retention ponds to the east and northeast are also getting a lot of work, so that when the rains return in the fall, the groundwater mitigation strategy should be well in place. In Texas, we're seeing a lot of rework in the parking. In some cases, it's asphalt being torn up to replace with concrete. In others, well, it's just rework. The cathode building seems to be on hold. The rumor is that there have been permitting issues. The main parking lot has had quite a few improvements, both in terms of drainage and the addition of power lines and lighting and whatnot. The solar panels are looking real nice. The A is filling out nicely, and this is just going great. The VOC retention pond regrade work is continuing. We're not sure what's going on here, but it's getting a lot of work. And across the highway, we're seeing activity. Some grading to the east of the established foundation area we thought we would see a few months back, but also just stuff kind of being shuffled around. Maybe something's going on over here. I don't know. What do you think? Back to you, Lars.